Cancer research published in May 2024 found another reason to limit L-glutamine intake and decrease the ability to make L-glutamine from protein amino acids. This is a promising development and, while the drug used in the study is not yet available, ongoing research is exploring ways to decrease the body's production of L-glutamine. In doing so, the immune system could be potentially better equipped to attack cancer cells. This drug is not available and may not be for several years. I often recommend that my clients consume loose leaf, green tea, matcha, or EGCG capsules before meals with protein to help decrease the body's production of L-glutamine and support immune function. It's important to note that while EGCG can be beneficial, excessive amounts can be toxic to the liver. Therefore, it's crucial to monitor liver enzymes in the blood and practice moderation when incorporating EGCG into your diet. Please share this information with loved ones with cancer and share my downloadable Cancer Keto Guide that's available in the Learning Center on my website. Together, we can prevail over cancer.